hello guys and uh, welcome to our channel so uh, as we told you in the last video we purchased an studio apartment here near constanza it's in navodar so this is also at the beach and uh, let me show you how it looks this this is the beach yes this is the navodar beach you can see here So we'll show you from the beach uh, uh, how far is our apartment. So you can see the complexes in between there. I'll try to zoom it. So there is our apartment. So it's not so far. It's really close. Like you can say on the left side is our apartment. And the right mm -hmm. side, the right side is, is the beach. Yeah. We also have a pavement so you can walk around. You can see on the left side there are the apartments. So everything is in construction right now. So the area is developing. So it's developing really fast. Yes, mostly people knew only Mamaya, but now the Navadar beach is also developing quite fast. So this uh, building on the right side wasn't uh, constructed two, two or three years ago. Yes, when I came to Romania, there was hardly any development. So you can see this is our place. So as you can see that is the main entrance. There is also guard over there. Then there are, these are the complexes. You can see the parking space. Surrounded by the boundary wall. And there is also a mini garden in between the blocks. So one thing is nice, like you can take a walk in the evening here. You don't need to step outside the complex. So the kids they can play here, there's also a restaurant, so it's closed because it's winter time. So usually the complex, it's in a complex and it is guarded uh, with a wall, you can see the complexes. There is a garden in between. The parking spaces are here. This one is a cafeteria. And there are the buildings that are being constructed and right in front of it is the sea. You can see it's like a five story building. And this is the entrance to our apartment. Mostly the door remains closed, so 
There is a code to open the door. These are the letter boxes. There's a lift. You can see the apartments. This was the entrance from where I entered. And Yona is in the apartment, so she'll show you the rest of the apartment. So as you enter, there is the washroom, the left side, this is the mirror, the lights, the washing machine. so it has the washing machine, though it doesn't have a tub, it's a shower, you can see the shower. Space, yeah. It's a the fridge, fridge, microwave. microwave. So we purchased these the electronics. Fridge. Nothing was here. Obviously, it's a new apartment, so. Just to bake something here. Mm -hmm. So the drawers, you see yeah. the utensils to keep the yeah, dustbin yeah. and the cleaning stuff, to keep the spoons, mm -hmm. knife. Yeah. More utensils. The coffee machine and the top you'll find the glasses, wine glasses, mugs and on this side it's when you wash the utensils you can leave it there to dry some food, yeah, yeah. Some food. the stove, some electronics over here mm -hmm. the best thing of this studio apartment is this wall So the kitchen is not separated as you can see, don't have a wall separating it, so it's a studio apartment, it's like 34 square meter, you can see the lighting there, conditioner, here we have the TV, so it's this uh, studio apartment is on the ground floor, so we don't have a balcony. Let me show you outside from the window. Car. There's a car parked over there. Parking space. Bit of greenery in front of our window. And here, where Yona is standing. So, the Centrala, this machine, yes. it uh, heats the apartment and also heats the water. So you don't need to put a separate geyser as we see in India in the washrooms and a vacuum cleaner. So, for many weeks, we were searching uh, the studio apartment, especially to be in our budget. And uh, the, you mostly will find these kind of apartments and it will cost you around uh, 70,000 euros. And the uh, apartment with two rooms, they are more expensive because it's at the sea. Same as in India, you'll find in Goa and Mumbai, the prices are really high near the seaside. And uh, uh, when you enter this apartment, uh, it's like a complex. So there is a guard 24 hours. You know, the parking space is yours in the summer. You don't have problems when the tourists come. 
and uh, most of the people they also buy the apartments here to rent in the summer time to make some money but you can also stay here 24 hours there is no problem you can reach uh, Constanza from here uh, in 15 to 20 minutes if you have a car and uh, you have also transport system the buses are here so it's not so far away it's like uh, 9 to 10 kilometers from here as it is a new apartment we don't know how are the bills in uh, the place where we we stayed in Constanza the bills were not so high especially in the winter time so I hope here it is the same yeah and the winter is approaching so let's see crossing our fingers because everything is getting expensive so hope the taxes are not so high and we'll keep you updated in the next video like how much is the bills and everything but for now you don't only need to pay for the guard salary but it's divided between everyone who is staying mm -hmm. here like in this building there are 80 residents and there are four complexes like this so 80 residents in every complex so the salary is divided and uh, we have to pay for the maintenance of the garden and the building and complex so there is a fixed price every month we have to pay because there is also a lift you need to pay for the electricity also so in the bills there is a common area where the uh, amount is fixed so you cannot change that and the rest of the bills which is like the electricity the water the gas which are using in your apartment it depends on you how much you consume it so for now you can say like uh, three to four thousand in indian rupees is a fixed amount which uh, you have to pay and above that is the utility bills and uh, hope you like the apartment and do subscribe the channel see you next time bye